What is going on guys? JT Gilly back with another video and today's video is going to start off with, oh my gosh, I can't believe I'm saying this. Today's video is going to start off with a Rayquaza raid. Today is the first day of Rayquaza weekend. We are hopping into the raid right now, 3, 2, 1, and here we go. We got our good squad with us, so I'm pretty sure we're going to be fine. And we're in a private group. Oh wait, I hella did in private group. I'm so sorry. Totally forgot. Well, there goes my friend bonus. That's going to suck. Hopefully we don't get a good one, but we're going in on Rayquaza right now. We got a solid party. We got 14 people. My apologies. Totally forgot to hop out of that raid. I was way too distracted because I'm so excited. This is my first Rayquaza raid of Rayquaza weekend. Man, has it been a while since I've seen Rayquaza on my screen, and I am so freaking happy. As you guys may know, Rayquaza is my favorite Pokemon of all time, so I'm so looking forward to this weekend. Still trying to get a good Rayquaza. I have a 98, I have a 96, I have some like 93s and 91s, but I want more good ones, of course. Anyways, Rayquaza is already in the red and and down it's about to go and down it goes there we go okay Rayquaza raid down already we got a couple of them to do today for everybody that is doing these Rayquaza raids make sure to let me know in the comments down below what your guys' best Rayquaza has been man I'm gonna be raiding all freaking weekend like I've always talked about I'm always like dude when Rayquaza comes out I'm gonna go off this is that weekend this is the time although I started kind of late today but hey I still have Saturday and Sunday gonna be raiding a lot anyways here we go let me get all that good stuff let's go we got 10 uh, we got 10,000 XP and nine balls again I did not private group totally forgot to do that uh, my apologies on that we'll definitely gonna get more balls in the next raid so the 100% IV is 2191 and then the boosted 100% IV is 2739 I don't think these are gonna be boosted but there it is there's a quasar right there yo 2131 what did I say okay 2191 yo my heart almost dropped if my first raid was going to be 100%. 2191 is the 100%. Yo, I almost flipped out. I don't know if you I don't know if I had a reaction because it was all in my head, but I just flipped out. Starting it out with a great. You love to see it. I'm going to try on every single Rayquaza I do. Do not care about the IVs at all. That's how we started off, baby. I almost lost my footing. That's how we started off. Rayquaza and I have the greatest relationship. There we go right there. 2131. I know it's going to be trash, but we're going to check it out anyways. There we are with our first Rayquaza going one for one on the first one. You know what it is. Looks like everybody's dipping off, and that means we found another Rayquaza raise. So let's go ahead and get to it, man. Yes. I'm so happy. Oh, we have a two-kilometer egg hatching right now. Just one of them. I know that for a fact. Let's get some fire. Shiny air on. Machop. Okay. Oh, shiny Machop. It could have been. All right. Alrighty, and here we are hopping in on the next Rayquaza raid. I have to kind of hurry up that. Okay, what are we doing here? What are we doing here? All right. We good? Nice. All right, hopping in on the next Rayquaza raid. Ended up going in a private group this time like I should have. So we're going to get a little bit more balls this time around, which is nice. We are standing right by a street, so I apologize if the cars go by and it's super loud, especially this car right here. Okay, anyways, we're going down Rayquaza. Already a quarter way down, man. Oh my god, I'm having such a good time already, and this is only my second raid. Don't worry if I don't do a lot of raids in this video. The next couple of videos are going to be pretty fire. Like tomorrow, I kind of want to stream, so I definitely might stream, but I would like to raid in the morning go home have some lunch raid again and then go home have some dinner and then maybe come out after dinner for some more raids like that's how many raids i would like to do hopefully 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 we can get ourselves a good rayquaza this weekend remember we only have three days so we don't have a ton of time but we do have a ton of opportunity that is definitely a fact people are going to be raiding all weekend literally from morning to end so i'm excited for that well down goes that rayquaza right there we might even get windy weather tomorrow which would be nice hoping for 2191 that is a 100 percent iv very much excited Excited to see what we got here. Let's go. Three rare candies, thousand stardust. Give me all that good stuff. Twelve balls. That's what I'm talking about. No shiny Rayquaza. No shiny Rayquaza. Twenty-one thirty-two. Just one CP higher than the uh, than the last raid. Okay, okay. I'm not mad. I'm not mad. It's Rayquaza. I can never be mad. Yo, like low key, a hundred percent IV Rayquaza. A hundred percent IV shiny Rayquaza could somehow run away from me, and I still wouldn't be mad at Rayquaza. And again, we won ball Rayquaza. I'm telling you the chemistry we have and the relationship we have nobody can touch what me and Rayquaza got going on right there that's what I'm talking about baby 2132 Rayquaza down let's go we have one more raid to do today I believe there's only one more 
of legendary egg hatching until until the raid stops. So we're gonna hit it. Hopefully it's uh, hopefully it's Rayquaza. I don't think it's hatched yet, so I don't think we know. But hopefully it's Rayquaza. If it's Dialga. I, I guess we'll do it, but we got a couple of things to talk about in this video as well We have some brand new news on a new event. I want to do a cool evolution in this video for now We're gonna head over to the next Rayquaza raid. That was awesome two for two so far. You gotta love it Let's see if we can keep this streak going. Okay, and here we are going in on the last raid and unfortunately Unfortunately, it is gonna be a Dialga raid not a Rayquaza raid So we didn't get a ton of them in today But like I said do not worry because we're gonna be getting a ton and I mean the ton like I literally made a ton Like too many to the point where I'm gonna have have to start skipping recording the raids and just letting you know how they go. For those of you that are probably wondering, no, obviously Rayqua Shiny Rayquaza did not come out because I would have mentioned it at least 40 times already. Um, yeah, it didn't come out this weekend like they said it wouldn't. So again, expect another Rayquaza event, maybe a week, maybe a weekend, maybe maybe a whole month. Uh, probably, I would assume in the summertime. Oh, I really died out. Sorry, I wasn't paying attention. Sorry about that. I know people get on me about not using my charge move either. When I'm talking and I'm looking at the camera and I'm just thinking about other stuff, I'm totally forgetting that I have a charge move available. I'm just tapping my life away. I'm assuming a Rayquaza event's gonna be coming probably in the summertime. That's when it makes the most sense. There's gonna be a lot of people out raiding, so that makes a lot of sense. But regardless, we'll get an event at some point with Rayquaza coming back and the shiny version being released. So, looking forward to whenever the heck that happens this raid took us a lot longer than it usually does I don't know what happened I don't know if people like air it out or, or I don't know if there's like low-level people in here I'm not exactly too sure what's going on but we got it taken down regardless that's all that matters down goes Dialga and boom there we go okay hoping for 2307 can we please you know what let me look let me look maybe that'll change the outcome if I actually look at the screen well nope 2242 still trash. I don't know what to do. <laughs> Dialga is uh, Dialga is definitely a Pokemon that I just cannot get a good version of and I have a very tough time catching. Boom, another excellent right there. You know what it is. Maybe this one will do the job. We're gonna have to find out, ladies and gentlemen. One, two, and three. Take it home, Dialga. You know what it is. Nice, so we went three for three on the day. I'm happy about that. I already checked those spawns. I am not doing that next Dialga raid. It is time to talk about some new event in Pokemon, a new event in Pokemon Go, and we're gonna do some cool evolutions. Uh, maybe Zuh? Uh, I don't know, but definitely cool evolution. Alrighty, and we made our way back home. And like I said, we got a couple of things to talk about today. We have a brand new event coming to Pokemon Go. I could completely miss my finger. Anyways, we got a brand new event coming to Pokemon Go. We're gonna do a brand new evolution. We got a really cool research task to claim. And something I gotta show you. I did it again. This something really, really cool happened to me again, and I gotta show you guys what this is. So we're gonna go ahead and get into all of that right now. Let's go ahead and start this off with the brand new event. Celebrate the equal Equinox with Pokemon Go. With spring days arriving in the northern hemisphere and autumn quickly approaching in the southern hemisphere, it is the perfect time to celebrate the coming Equinox with some grass type Pokemon. This event is going to last from March 19th at 1 p.m. to March 26th at 1 p.m., so a week long event. Features of this event, grass type Pokemon like Oddish, Execute, Sunkern, and Shroomish will appear more frequently in the wild. Lunatone and Solrock will switch hemispheres at the start of the event in, the, in celebration of the Equinox. These Pokemon will stay in their new hemispheres after the event. Raids. Grass type Pokemon will be available to challenge in raids. That's cool. Probably expect like, uh, I don't know, Venusaur or something like that. It's something cool. That's a grass type Pokemon. Field research. Limited time grass type Pokemon. Field research will be available during this event. Move. New moves will be permanently added to the game. Acid Spray is coming to the Pokemon named here. Arbok, Victory Belt, Tentacruel, Muck, Alolan Muck, Quagsire, Quillfish, Octillery, and Swalot. And a Leaf Tornado is another move coming to Victory Bell and Shiftry. So those are some cool moves coming to Pokemon Go. Permanently added, meaning as soon as this event goes live, well hopefully, but a little bit after, just, just wait till a little bit after the event goes live, you can just throw on a Charge TM or evolve to these Pokemon, and they should be able to learn those moves. You guys know me, first thing I noticed, it mentions no shiny Pokemon. Now, that does not mean we're not gonna get a shiny Pokemon because unlike Rayquaza Weekend, they didn't clearly tell us we're not getting one, they just didn't include it. Um, I'm pretty sure, I'm like, I'm 100% sure we're gonna get a shiny with this event. Which one is it gonna be? Probably Oddish because they put Oddish in the picture. Kind of a, you know, kind of a underwhelming event some people thought. You know, I'm gonna give my honest opinion. It's a cool event, grass-type Pokemon, sure, new raid, sure, new move, sure, new shinies, of course. 
Um, just, you know, not the craziest thing ever, but it's an event. I can't complain. And who knows, maybe, just maybe, we will get the uh, Generation 4 Evolution from Eevee Leafeon. Maybe we'll get that with this event somehow. I don't know how they're going to do it. Maybe they're going to introduce new stones in the game. We're going to have to find out. We'll see, but anyways, pretty cool. And like I said, I do want to do a very cool evolution this video, so we're going to go ahead and do this evolution ride. Her, We got ourselves a Porygon 2, 98%. I've been holding onto this bad boy for a while since 2017. Oh my gosh, that is two years ago. That's so. That feels so weird to say. Evolving this bad boy right now, 98%. It's got HP, attack. Okay, wait, I thought it might have been 100. It's got HP, attack. Let's go ahead and evolve to our first ever Porygon. Wait, this is Porygon too right let's evolve to our first ever porygon z in pokemon go let's go ahead and use our Sinnoh stone right there bada bing bada boom make sure to let me know in the comments down below if you guys have yourself a porygon z we also just completed the research task to use an item to evolve a pokemon that should award us with an aerodactyl so that'd be a very cool shiny if we can get that there is porygon z in pokemon go looking super super dope Yo, add it to the Generation 4 Pokedex. I still need Gallade, okay. Um, there it is, 1861, multiplier, not that high. Brand new Generation 4 evolution right there. Very happy about that. It's got Charge Beam and Solar Beam. Cool, cool, cool. That is awesome. Again, make sure to let me know if you guys got that. Hold on, I was editing the video and I totally forgot to include my research task of myself getting the Aerodactyl, but I actually went ahead and claimed it already. It was not as shiny. But ladies and gentlemen, I can't make this stuff up. Go ahead and look at it right here. 1193 CP. Let me check the IVs on that bad boy. Just, just, just look. That's 100% IV Aerodactyl hatch, or uh, from the task right there. No freaking way. My first one ever. An amazing 100% IV hatch. I can't, or uh from the task. I can't believe I wasn't recording. I can't believe I forgot to add that, but I had to throw that in there. There was no way. If it was bad, I was probably going to be like, eh, they probably knew that it was a bad one. I didn't include it. This is 100% IV. I'm glad. I'm glad I checked it. That's awesome. Anyways, let's get back to the video. And now we have to talk about this little shiny Pokemon. Oh, God, I kind of spoiled it. I mean, you guys knew what was going on. We got to talk about a little something, something that I, uh, that I got. Okay, so this is something none of you guys have seen. You guys do not know that I have this Pokemon up until right now because I wanted to hold it off for you guys for a cool time. And I believe this is a cool time. Ladies and gentlemen, it happened again. We hashed ourselves another shiny Pokemon. Let's go ahead and see what it's gonna be. Open the alone egg. Bada bing, bada boom. Shiny why not out of nowhere. Yo, another shiny why not hatch. That's my third one ever. It happened again. That's my third one ever. And it has HP and attack on it. Yo, when this happened, I was like, oh, oh. You guys can't see the time right there, but this happened at 1.20 a.m. And for some reason, I was hatching some alone eggs, and I was like, I should probably turn my screen recorder on. I feel like something's gonna, I don't know, you know, I never wanna miss anything. First freaking hatch of the batch. We got ourselves that bad boy right there. Shiny, why not Pokemon Go, very, very awesome. Another Alolan egg going down right there. Ha pity, nice. That's, we already got that in the Pokedex, so that's not too big of a deal. Oh, that was actually my Pokedex of Penny, so that was a while ago. <laughs> Sorry about that. There's my Pokedex of Penny from the time. Okay, cool. Another little egg hatching right here, and we got ourselves a Badoo. Got a lot of those, man. Those are really common in the seven kilometers. Egg number four coming through. Can we get some fire? Bang! Another Penny. Two out of three. You gotta love it. And that's that's right after my Pokedex. So I was super happy about that. And actually, that was the last alone egg that we hatched right there. But that was an awesome little sequence. We got ourselves our third shiny why not man we are on fire with these with these low and egg hatches dude although i haven't hatched them in a long time but i have nine batching right now or nine incubating right now yo i'm telling you these low and eggs are all i was gonna say always most of the time they're pretty fire if you open nine eggs there's a good chance at least one of those at least one of those um is gonna be pretty fire whether it's a shiny or a rare pokemon or a good iv i don't know i love these the, the alolan egg pool right now but that was that hope you guys enjoyed today's video if you guys did make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you guys have not already brand new event in pokemon go rayquaza weekend which i'm gonna go out and, and, and raid way more today so i'm excited about that new generation 4 evolution and finally we hacked ourselves a shiny why not we did it again ladies and gentlemen make sure to let me know if you guys have hatched any shinies yourselves 
Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you guys have not already. I will see your faces later. Good luck on these requests, by the way. If you guys get any good ones, make sure you trade them over to me. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate you. I'll see your faces later. I know, by the way, I know that IVs don't trade over. I'm saying, like, if you get a weather boosted one and you see me, I'll take it. Unless you have a shiny Charmander, because then I want that. Anyways, you guys have a good rest of your day. I will see your faces later. Deuces.